hello kids welcome to math tutor today we are going to learn how to add fractions in adding fractions there are two cases adding like fractions the first case we are going to see now let us see 1 by 5 and 3 by 5 they have the same denominator as 5 so they are like fractions now how to add 1 by 5 5 plus 3 by 5 take the denominator as it is 5 here since it is same for both the fractions and then at the top just add the numerators 1 and 3 One plus three equal to four, and denominator is five. Let us see one more example. Three by eight plus two by eight. As both are like fractions, the denominator will be the same eight as it is, and just you have to add both the numerators three and two. Three plus two equal to five by eight. One more example. Four by eleven plus five by eleven. As you can see, both have the same denominator eleven. I'm keeping eleven here as it is, and then what I'm going to do? I'm going to add just the numerators four and five. Four plus five equal to nine by eleven is the answer. Adding like fractions is very easy. Now let's see how to add unlike fractions. Now let us see how to add unlike fractions. What are unlike fractions? If their denominators are different, like here we have the fraction one by two, where two is the denominator. And I have another fraction one by three, where three is the denominator. Now I have to add both the fractions. But here the denominators are different. So what I need to do? First step, remember, you have to find the LCM of two and three. What will be the LCM of two and three? It will be six. So. What I am going to do? Just focus here. I am going to keep the fractions separate, and this LCM six will be the new denominator for both the fractions. Understand? So what I am going to do? I am going to write the fractions separately. And the six will be the LCM six will be the new denominator for both the fractions. And then what I'm going to do? I am going to write the fractions as it is one by two here and one by three here. Okay. Now you can ask me. Now new denominator is six, but you wrote the earlier denominator two. Now there is an important step here. What is that important step? You have to multiply the denominator two with the number so that you get six. So two times three equal to six. Since we are multiplying the denominator with three, we have to multiply the same number three with the numerator also. This is done. Same process we are going to repeat for the second fraction. What number I have to multiply three to get six? I have to multiply with two. The same number I have to multiply the numerator also with the same number two. Round it off. Now my new denominator is six, and for the second fraction also my denominator will be six. Now two times three equal to six, and one times three is three. 
3 times 2 is 6 and 1 times 2 is 2. Now we have turned the unlike fractions into like fractions. Denominator is the same. And what to need to do? This is very simple. Keep the denominator down as it is and just add the numerators 3 and 2. 3 plus 2 equal to 5 by 6. Understand? Let us see one more example. How to add 3 by 8 and 1 by 16. Here if you can see both the denominators are different. So first step what I need to do? I have to find the LCM of 8 and 16. What will be the LCM of 8 and 16? 8 and 16 if I take the LCM. 2 4s are 8. 2 is are 16. Again 2. 2 2 2 4. 2 4s are 8. <coughs> so the LCM will be multiplying all the numbers here. That is 16. So I got LCM is as 16. This LCM 16 will be the new denominator. Right. So this LCM 16 will be the new denominator for both the fractions. Okay. I am keeping the 16 in a circle so that it is easy to understand. Now next step what I am going to do. I am going to write my original fraction 3 by 8 here and 1 by 16 here as it is. Now do you remember the next step we have to multiply numerator and denominator with the same number. So I am keeping my multiplication symbol ready. Now here 8 is the denominator but what is the denominator I should get 16. So, what number I should multiply 8 to get 16? I have to multiply 8 with 2. I will get 16, right? Since I am multiplying the denominator, I have to multiply the numerator with the same number 2. Understood? I have to multiply the numerator with the same number 2. This is done. Let's go to the second fraction 1 by 16. Since 16 is already there, and 16 is here, I have to multiply denominator with 1 and 1 in the numerator also. 16 ones are 16, right? So, I am multiplying the numerator with the same number. Now, let's proceed to the next one. 3 times 2 equal to 6. My new denominator 16 is here. And 1 ones are 1 and 16. Now, what we did here? We have converted the Unlike fraction into like fraction. We got 16 as the denominator. Now it's very easy. Keep the denominator 16 here and just add the numerators 6 and 1. 6 plus 1 equal to 7 by 16. Example 7 by 11 plus 1 by 5. Both are unlike fractions. So what we need to do first we have to find the LCM of 5 and 11. So it will be 55 will be the LCM for 5 and 11. This will be our new denominator. Remember for unlike fractions first we have to find the LCM. That LCM will be the new denominator for both the fractions. Okay. Now what I need to do? I have to write my original fractions as it is. 7 by 11 here. And my second fraction 1 by 5 here. So now next what I need to do? My new denominator is 55. Right. With what number I have to multiply 11 to get 55. Right, so I have to multiply 11 with 5 so that I will get the denominator as 55. Since I am multiplying denominator with 5, numerator also I have to multiply with the same number 5. Understand? Now let's go to the second fraction here 1 by 5. 
with what number i have to multiply 5 to get 55 11 right so numerator also i have to multiply the same number 11 kids remember this is a very important step that you need to understand why we are doing this okay after doing this step it's very easy just you have to multiply 7 times 5 is 35 11 5 is 55 plus 1 11 is 11 by 5 11 is 55 now since the unlike fraction become a like fraction with the same denominator I am keeping the denominator down same and just add in both the numerators 35 and 11. So 35 plus 11 becomes 46 by 55. Kids, I hope you understood the additional fractions. If you have any doubts, you can message me. Thank you for watching.